I expect that you are watching these videos to overcome your mistakes. You can correct your simple mistakes before you go deep into it. And hopefully you can see huge advancement in building your confidence. Here is the problem from numerical solutions of ordinary differential equations. And using Euler's method, we have to solve for y at x is equal to 2 from dy by dx is equal to 3x squared plus 1 given y at 1 is equal to 2 taking the step size h is equal to 0 0.5 here it is given that f of x comma y is equal to dy by dx is equal to this is 3x squared plus 1 and we have to construct this as a function in x comma y as 3x squared plus 1 and again it is given that y at 1 is equal to 2 which means y naught is equal to 2 and x naught is equal to 1. So now according to the Euler's method, so we have to use the Euler's method and in that method we have a formula that y n plus 1 is equal to y n plus h times of f of x n into y n. So now I am going to keep it. Here, h value is equal to h, the step size value is given as h is equal to 0 0.5. And now, I have to keep n is equal to 0. So, this will become y1 is equal to, this is y0 plus h times of f of x0 into y0. So, y1 value is equal to, what is x0? x0 is nothing but 2 and h is equal to 0 0.5 and f of x0, this is 1 comma 2. So, we have f of x comma y value as see this is 3x square plus 1 so it is given here as 3x square plus 1 so if i substitute this one this is going to be 2 plus 0 0.5 times of this is 3 into what is in place of x 1 square plus 1 so y1 is equal to 2 plus 0 0.5 into this is 3 plus 1 that is 4 y1 is equal to 2 plus this is 0 0.5 into 4. So, half of 4 is nothing but 2. Therefore, y1 is equal to this is 2 plus 2. y1 is equal to 4. And how about x1? So, x1 is nothing but x0 plus h. What is x0 here? x0 is 1. And what is our h value? h value is 0 0.5. So, our x1 value is 1.5. I got x1 y1 value and this is shown here. And the next step is, so in the Euler's modified method, we have to substitute n is equal to. So now we have to take, in this Euler's modified method, we have to take n is equal to 2 this time. So 1 this time. So if I keep 1 here, 1 plus 1, this is 2 is equal to, this is y1 plus h times of f of x1, y1. Just now, what is x1 value and what is y1 value? So, x1 value is 1.5 and y1 value, this is 4. And h value, this is uh, 0 0.5. So, now if I substitute all these values, then y2 is equal to, y2 is equal to, this is 4 plus 0 0.5 times of f of x1, that is 1.5 comma y1. What is y1? This is 4. As you know that f of x comma y value is nothing but this is 3x square plus 1. So y2 value is equal to 4 plus 0 0.5 times of this is 3 into 1.5 whole square plus 1. So now if I go with the calc, see this is 3 into 1.5 square plus 1 into 0 0.5 plus 4. So, what is the value here? This is a 7 point. This value is 7.875. And uh, x2 is equal to, this is x1 plus h. So, what is x1 value? So, x1 value is nothing but 1.5. And what is our h value? This is 0 0.5. So, x2 is equal to, this is 2.0. So, x2 value I got as 2. So, x2 value is 2. And later, we have to go with y3. So, what is the formula according to the Euler's uh, 
Euler's method that is y n plus 1 is equal to this is y n plus h times of f of x n into y n. So now I have to keep n is equal to 2. So if I keep this will be 2 plus 1 this value is 3. This is y 2 plus h times of f at x 2 this is y 2. So every value is ready here if I substitute what is y2? y2 is nothing but 7.875 plus h is nothing but 0 0.5 and what is x2? This is 2.0 comma. What is y2 here? That is 7.875. So according to our question here, f of x comma y is nothing but 3x square plus 1. If I substitute the same thing, y3 is equal to 7.875 plus 0 0.5 into 3x square. So what is x here? That is 2 square plus 1. So y3 is equal to 7.875 plus 0 0.5 times. So 4 3 is a 12 plus 1. This is 13. So if you see, this is 7.875 plus this is 0 0.5 into 13. This value is nothing but this is 14 point this value is this value is nothing but this is 14.375 so after I got this value by 3 so what is x3 x3 is nothing but x2 plus h so x3 is equal to what is x2 this is 2 plus h is nothing but 0 0.5 and x3 value is 2.5. So, these are the values of y at uh, this is x value and this is y value. So, x1, so what is given here? So, here initially what is given x0, y0 at 0. See here at some values this value is 0. And uh, this value is from what is x1 value. So what is x1? This is 1.5. At, uh, at x is equal to 1.5 at 2. And this one is 2.5. When x is equal to 0. See when x is equal to 0. So here it is not there. One, from 1 it is started. When x is equal to 1 y value is nothing but y value is nothing but 2 when x is equal to 1.5 then y1 value is 4 this value is 4 when x x2 is equal to 2 then this value is 7.875 when x3 is equal to 2.5 this value is 14.375 these are the initial values so these are the euler Euler modified according, oh no, no, these are the values from Euler's method and initially when x is equal to 1, so this is not 0, 1 and when x is equal to 1.5, this is 2 and 2.5, we got the y values are, this is y1, this is, sorry, this is y0, y1, y2 and y3, these values are x0, x1, x2 and this is x3, this is how we have to frame all the values. So, depending upon this Euler form, there is another problem. Very simple. Given that y dash is equal to x square minus y, y at 0 is equal to 1. Find correct to 4 decimal places the value of y at 0 0.1. Only it is asked at y at 0 0.1 using Euler's method. It is given that y dash is equal to x square minus y. So, which we can write as f of x comma y is equal to x square minus y. And again, it is given that y not y at 0 is equal to 1 so which means y not is equal to 1 and x not is equal to 0 so here if you observe this one this value is equal to see here according to the Euler's method according to the Euler's method so h is equal to 0 0.1 according to the Euler's method we have a formula that y at n plus 1 is equal to this is yn plus h times of f of xn into yn in this if we keep n is equal to 0 this value will become y1 is equal to y0 plus h times of f of x0 
y not y1 is equal to what is y not here this is 1 plus h is equal to 0 0.1 times x not this is 0 and y not this is 1 so we have to write as f of x comma y as this is x square minus y so if i substitute here y1 is equal to 1 plus 0 0.1 into x square so 0 square minus 1 so y1 is equal to 1 plus 0 0.1 into 0 minus 1 is again minus 1 so y1 is equal to 1 minus 0 0.1 the which is equal to 0 0.9 so y at 0 0.1 value is 0 0.9 so this is how we have to solve using Euler's method so this is very simple so this is Euler's method and in the next videos I am going to upload Euler's modified method that is a equation most important question keep practicing daily and keep informing through your comments and stay connected visit this channel thoroughly and subscribe to this channel and share it with your friends if you really like don't forget to raise your thumb thank you so much